West back with another video. And today, you know it's been a while, so I gotta bless y'all with some helpful dog tips. You know what I'm saying? So, first helpful dog tip. Apple cider vinegar. Now, for all my people, all my breeders, for some reason, I don't know, maybe you want uh, to sell the female or maybe you want to uh, put her in the show fast or something after she had a litter or something like that. This is what you put on your female's nipples to make her nipples go back in so they won't be sagging and hanging. Do this for about two, three days. Nipples is gonna go back up fast as hell. Um, only problem is it smells really bad. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna have to use your gloves. Um, you know, may possibly do it while the dog is outside so you don't spill it everywhere. But uh, yeah, man, apple cider vinegar. That's for the females when the, the nipples are sagging after they have a litter. Next helpful dog tip. Uh, all right, so this one is like a real gem right here, okay? Uh, I was hesitant to let y'all know about this because it's kind of like a glitch in the matrix. And also, um, I guess it's cool since, you know, I wanted to do it before my following get real crazy because this is, we're going deep now. This is for real breeders right here, all right? So, next tip. All right, so if your dog has any type of skin issues, uh, let's say urinary tract infection, uh, ear skin issues, um, any type of stomach infection, um, any type of just uh, cuts, maybe the dog's gotten fights, you know what I'm saying? Um, if you guys uh, go to a hood vet who did your C-section, uh, you might possibly get some of these pills and he'll tell you uh, to give it to your dog twice a day so the part where they did the surgical doesn't get infected. Now what this is, this is antibiotics and you do need a prescription for it, but this is why this is a gem. I figured out how you can get this without a prescription. All right, y'all. Now, let me show you what it is. This is called cephalexin. It's, it kills bacteria. I just explained to you what it does. Uh, usually, you got to get it uh, prescribed, but I figured out how you can get it, guys. All right. Promise not to tell nobody. Don't blow up the spot. All right. So, let me show it to you. This is cephalexin from Chewy.com, and you go into the fish section. So basically, this is used to, uh, you know, kill the bacteria in your uh, fish tank, you know what I'm saying? But um, ironically, it's the same exact cephalexin, cephalexin that you get subscribed when you have these uh, symptoms that I said before for uh, either dogs and humans, you know what I'm saying? So. So basically, y'all keep that on the low. So I did see um, a video recently where a, uh, a man had a Frenchie, had some serious skin issues, you know what I'm saying? I recommend that you try the cephalexin. Um, you should do it for seven days straight. Depending on the weight of the dog, if it's a Frenchie, you should just do one a day. If it's a big bully, you should do two a day. Um, also, do not give this to your dog on an empty stomach because it's possible that uh, the dog could get diarrhea. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all know that. Y'all know, never take pills on an empty stomach. So, um, basically, this is one of the jewels, one of the tips. I hope y'all appreciate it. This is real deal breeder stuff right here, y'all. I've been a breeder for uh, going on seven years now. Plenty of litters, you know what I'm saying? Um, if you look at my old videos, you see, we got plenty of gems that I dropped. That's real deal gems that can help you so you don't lose pups. So you don't, you know, you can avoid these little things like skin infections and stuff like that. So also kennel cough, stuff like that. Y'all take a look at my old videos and uh, go find those gems. They in there, man. We got to keep it on the low. So this right here, it's the same thing. This is amoxicillin. This is what you should be giving your puppies when they turn five weeks. You take the pill. You spread, break it apart and you sprinkle it on the food and their mush. Uh, 
this will make sure they don't have any type of you know stomach infections they won't be uh you know having any type of issues with their bowels or their uh you know their bladder so amoxicillin is an antibiotics as well you can get this from chewy.com too under the fish section um it's the same exact pills these come in uh 250 milligrams though instead of the uh the 500 like the cephalexin and uh they're basically the same thing but in my personal opinion i, I feel like the cephalexin is a little bit more uh stronger and more effective but um yeah y'all there you have it just showed y'all how y'all can get you some medicine um you know without the prescription so you know what I'm saying y'all hit the like and uh, like and subscribe if you uh, enjoyed this content if you felt this uh, found this useful. Um, this is just the beginning of the video. Um, let's see if we can uh, show y'all some dogs real quick, man. All right, so it's TBK West, stay tuned. Yes, sir. I see this is my uh, two pups from Roca Times, Lou Ferrigno. They're about seven weeks. Looking real good. See this little dude right here. He available. But this one right here, the one I showed you on the previous video. This dude is really short and compact. Just thinking about keeping him, man. I don't know y'all. I'm saying he's looking real good. You gonna know, see, I'm gonna wait a little longer. See how he look when he get a little bit bigger. Cause you see he's short, man. This is seven weeks. These dudes looking like they both three and four weeks still, so. Yes, sir. Just thinking about keeping him, I don't know, man. But this little dude right here is definitely available for rehome. I'm gonna get y'all some closer footage of these little dudes in a second. Make sure make sure y'all stay tuned, you tap in. Um, we got that Trinity litter on the way. Any day now, this will probably be Last time y'all see me for at least 48 hours because that litter is coming. Um, what else? Um, I'm going to try to go see Sprinkles. I'm going to see if uh, TBK Weasel will bring her over here tomorrow, man, because y'all need to see her. He uh, keep telling me how she looked like she took, so I need to go over there and give her an inspection. I mean, inspection her uh, day 40 is tomorrow, I believe. So, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. It's kind of chilly out here. I just want to let them get some fresh air real quick. I just clean this area down so it's nice and sanitized. But, um, yeah, man, I'm going to stop rambling and let y'all get some footage of these little two brothers right here. These are two males, by the way. Um, Pretty confident they carry chocolate. Um, seven week old. It was just a three pup litter. Their sister didn't make it. The two brothers, the twins. But yeah, y'all. I'm, uh, I'm actually about to change. Um, we're about to uh, do some family stuff real quick, man. You know me. You know I'm always doing some going out with the fam, and uh, it's good. Like it's like therapeutic. It's good to show y'all because a lot of people on my personal page want, always want to see what my life is like and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Because I never post online. I don't. I never post uh, anything personal or anything like that on my social media. So. Like a lot of people would be curious, like how does this nigga really live and stuff. So y'all get to see it before them through the channel, you know. Cause this is regular everyday stuff. It's, I'm not posting that to cap on y'all, to floss or nothing like that. That's just normal activities with my family, man. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, y'all, this TBK West signing out. I appreciate y'all for tapping in. Can't wait to see this litter coming up in the next day or two. And, uh, 
Yes, sir. To the next one, man. Go on.
down, but I always had a plan to find another way.